Watch and new developments tonight at the homeless camp off I-90. WashDOT has hired private security to provide 24-7 patrol at the camp. The security will work with staff to control access to each entry gate. Meanwhile, WashDOT says they'll bring in more security in the next few days. Again, to be clear, the security hired is not law enforcement. And we also learned tonight Jules Helping Hands worked with WashDOT to create a set of rules for all residents living at the encampment that they must follow if they want to keep living there. One rule listed states that residents are not allowed to engage in predatory behavior at or around the site, which includes drug dealing, stealing or abusive behavior. Residents must also follow the good neighbor policy, which requires adhering to that 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. curfew and quiet hours, respecting the property and the surrounding neighborhood, and not gossiping about other residents or staff working at the camp. We also learned an update on how many people are living at the camp now. The latest headcount sits at 443 residents, down by about 180 from its peak in the summer. Around 40 have gone to that new Trent Avenue shelter.